Hello everyone and welcome to episode 26, I'm pretty sure, of Monster Hunter Freedom Unite. So today we're going to be doing Silver Rathlos, um, but just before we get into that I just wanted to say a few things. Um, so for those that know I do game dev, um, I just released my demo last night, there were a bunch of issues so I've spent half, like, most of the day fixing things that I forgot about. But anyway, so the demo is out, um, there are some FPS issues, but I'm going to put a link in the description if I remember, hopefully. Um, for you guys if you want to go check it out you don't have to of course but if you want to you can um and let me know what you think if you do but yeah so we're gonna be doing silver wrath loss today i am quite scared we just have our normal stuff oh actually um do any of this do you sell like um anything like fuck up oh, no, i don't need that there's no thingy there I was really hoping that they would sell, that one of these would sell, um, like life powders or something, but that's in world. You have to craft it in this game. Yeah. Whatever, we're just going to give it a try as it is. So hopefully we can do it. Um, I'm going to try and be a bit more cautious than I was with Gold Rathian. Like at the start of Gold Rathian, I wasn't cautious. Um, so I'm going to try and be a bit more cautious. I don't have any, like, thing to buff myself either though, so. We're just going to have to try. Oh yuck! <laughs> Scary. <laughs> I've never. I've always had so many issues with Rathalos. So just keep in mind, it is possible of having a failure. Um, just I've never. Just because I've never been good with Rathalos. But we're gonna try and keep positive. Also, oh, this dude is giant. This must be a gold crown as well. I just. I don't like how much he flies. I've always had an issue with that because obviously I'm. I'm not a ranged. Uh, weapon user. So, I mean, <laughs> it it takes away the time that I can attack him. I mean, at least I get some good tail hits. I'm just trying it. And there's that. That's, like, that's going to be one of the biggest issues. But either way, um, I may have to upgrade my armor <laughs> if we fail this. Um, hopefully not, though. Well, I mean, hopefully not fail. Like, I mean, upgrading armor is fine. At least I can get this tail. This tail should be relatively easy to get because of all of this. I mean, if I hit the tail, that is. Okay. He's angry already? Oh no. Whoa. I need to get my weapon away so I can actually sprint. <laughs> also, um, sorry about the, uh, the little breakdown I did of the trailer, the other trailer. For wilds, um, I know it was very, very low energy. Um, it's because people were home, um, and I don't like recording when other people were home, so I was having to be really quiet. Um, so yeah, uh, that's that's my excuse. I don't have any other excuse. <laughs> Where are you going? He's uh, below the cloud layer. He landed down there. <laughs> Come on. Imagine if they didn't add a failsafe for that and he just stays down there the whole time. That'd be a funny bug. Give me that tail. Oh, I think it's raining. Outside in real life, not in the game. <laughs> but I'm so keen for wilds, and I especially love that they've pretty much only shown... I mean, obviously they showed Rathalos, but other than that... They've only shown new monsters, and um, so it's making me think that, you know, hopefully the roster's going to be predominantly new monsters. Obviously, I love returning monsters, that's great. Returning monsters is always awesome. Um, but it's obviously also really good just to get completely new monsters. I especially love the little sandworm leviathan. I really feel like they could have made it a snake wyvern instead. Um, I mean, obviously leviathan's cool, I love leviathans. Um, but I feel like for it's like, like for what it is, it would have made a bit more sense for it not to have legs and being a snake wyvern, or just had like tiny legs. But that's just me. Oh no, I'm dead. Already. Okay, good, went for the cat. I don't feel like I've done much damage yet, that's the problem. Just because he's his pa movement pattern is very um 
very annoying, especially compared to Gold Rathian. I mean, like, it's not super different, but it's different enough. I really do want that tail, but I'll, I'm not going to try and focus on it. I just want to, I want to focus on doing damage. And if it means I get the tail, then it means I get the tail. And plus, when he goes up into the air, that's when I can hit the tail the most anyway. I'm hit. Mm, oh, I shouldn't have done that. That was my mistake. I just, I didn't think I was going to be able to avoid it, so I was trying to put my weapon away in time. I, I reckon I would have died either way. Speaking of my, well not, I wasn't speaking about it, but with my game thing, it's actually, I'm actually uploading a, uh, a build right now. Um, I, I hate having to do updates, because like, the way that Unity works for me, for some reason, because I use Unity, and I've just always used it and find it easy. Um, well, the build to begin with takes 30 to 40 minutes. I'm dead, again. <sighs> I hate this monster. Anyway, the build takes that time. Um, and then, for me, the off like, I mean, the build's like 9 gig, and my internet's Australian internet, so the build takes me like an hour to an hour and a half to upload. So, you know, even if, if I'm doing like a tiny fix, even just, um, say I just, I don't know, fix the boolean on a script or something then I'm basically logged into two to three hours of submitting that and getting it like put in. Yeah, honestly, I'm tempted just to abandon um, and just do a different fight. I really, I, I don't feel like this is going well. I'm already on two deaths. I will heal at least. I was on one, I only had one life left with the gold Rathian for quite a while as well, so I will keep trying at least. Um, but if I do fail, I won't do it again for now. Um, I'll just do another quest. I don't have any other um, key quests unlocked besides, besides the Shengaren, but I don't have um, Quake Resist, so I won't do that either. I'll just do like a random quest. Just a monster I haven't fought yet. Oh, that was my mistake. And um, because I'm pretty sure I have like a Kieran, a uh, Kushala, you know, those sort of monsters. Oh, come on. Well, <laughs> That was uh, one of the quickest quests I've done. Hope you guys enjoyed that quest. That was great. Yeah. Um, let's see what we can do. I'm not going to grab it yet because I need I need to um. What's it called? Eat. Um. Anything in here? So we got a Kieran. I mean, this might be even more annoying. Okay, this <laughs> I could fail this as well. You never know. Um. Hopefully not. I mean, I've. I've always had issues with wrath loss, as I've said, um, so I'm obviously just going to have to, I'm going to have to get some new gear, um, and then go from there. I have no idea where Kieran will be in this area, to be honest, like in this uh, map, I mean. I don't remember, honestly, I don't remember ever fighting a Kieran in this area, so. I've got no idea. Oh, there we go. <laughs> of course, in the area with uh, Bullfangos, you know, where else would you want them to be? Okay. Oh, I really want to get rid of these um, Bullfangos. Oh, bouncing yuck. Oh, I make such stupid mistakes at times. I'm 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 remembering like the pattern of Kieran in other games. So I'm like it's hard to remember Kieran in every single game. Because I mean Kieran's in most Monster Hunter games. And I fought him I think most recently in World, which obviously has a completely different pattern. Okay. <laughs> it's 
So I, oh, it's because my um my gauge is up. I was gonna say why am I able to hit it now and I couldn't before, but it's yeah, my gauge is up. Oh really? I rolled right into that. It's because the the controller. It's confusing when you're facing like the the controls. They're just different. When you're facing backwards, it's the opposite. And I'm not used to that. Really? God, I hate you. And K Kieran, really? You just gave him the assist. Oh my god. Give me a minute, Kieran. I need to kill these idiots. There we go. Can't see anything. <laughs> You're trying to drown yourself, Kieran. Jeez. I didn't know your life was that bad. Oh, I thought it... See, I was used to the world one. Like, it does that move, obviously, but it's it, it puts it puts the dot down a bit quicker than that. I can't trust this, I don't... Going in! Well... Can you stop dying in like 0.5 seconds, cat? I, I need the distraction. Oh my god. And this camera is abysmal. Okay. When do you get a chance to attack? Jeez. You get like... Oh my god, I'm so sick and tired of this monster already. You literally don't get a chance to attack. You can do like one hit max. I mean, at that rate it would take like four hours to kill. Okay, finally got some time. Oh, I've got a full combo in. Oh. Lovely. Where were you, you useless cat? No, he's angry. I don't like this area either. The ground it's con makes it confusing. Well, it's not confusing, it's just like, it's weird. Because like, I feel like I'm running so slow this way and super fast this way. So it makes my judgement a little bit off. This is a pain without having um, the gauge up full as well. Get that head, bounce off everything else. I was lucky not to get hit there. <laughs> nice. Turn around, bro, I'm gonna slap your head. Okay, never mind. Got the gauge back. Okay, ship sharpness gone though. I thought he was changing zones. Perfect. Even though I'm technically bouncing because my sharpness. That was close. <laughs> and the cat's hit immediately, so I'm guessing the cat's already dead. The cat really is useless in this game. <laughs> it's just because you can't upgrade anything on the cat or like get him new armor. 
So it's just, you know, one and done. Going for the cat, pretty sure. Yeah. Why did I go in? Okay, <laughs> that chip damage is insane just from a, a, a drive-by. Oh my god. I'm surprised Kieran doesn't have its own music. Really? I honestly don't even remember Kieran ever doing that charge attack. Like when I played back in the day. Oh nice. Oh, didn't get much of a hit off. Uh, in that time though, but better than nothing. Actually, no, we got got some decent hits actually because he was knocked over. I gotta watch out. Okay, and this will be the dot. I could have gone in there. I thought it was doing the other one though. I didn't realize it was doing the distance one. Okay, this is Dot. Me. Missed. <laughs> oh, that hitbox is so dog. Oh, we're dead. I'm surprised I didn't die to that Geo, uh, Vils of Prey. Can you go in the... Oh my god. That zone transition was way in. Yep. Bullfangos. Just what I need. Just gonna take this opportunity to heal up. Go away. No, that one hadn't even despawned yet. I thought that was a new one spawning in. One thing about this game, though, is that, like this map and other maps with this type of like trees and stuff, and it's so annoying to see when you're not in a clear area. Oh, come on, mate! I'm so glad um, in world and stuff the the small monsters don't just randomly assault you while you're fighting a large monster. Because it really doesn't make much sense. <laughs> I mean, obviously it's, you know, the, uh, the just how they did it. Probably because, you know, they have one type of AI, not multiple. They'd probably be m much more intensive on the PSP if they had, say, two or three different uh, AI models per thing. Really? That was my fault as well. That makes it more annoying. Okay, just miss. I mean, I don't even really need a paintball on this dude, because, I mean, it's not like he flies or anything. Um, but I'm just doing it just in case, pretty much. What are you doing in there? I've seen more weirdness this quest than I think I ever saw in the PSP. That seems to be a common theme. Yep, cat's dead again. Useless. The cat seriously is so useless in this game. I'm surprised they even bothered having it in the game. Like, it wouldn't even be a difference if they just removed it. Obviously, they're not going to do that now. That'd be weird to update something after such a long time and make it negative. Oh god. 
I'm, I'm not going to be able to do this quest. Another quest. I mean, just... I don't have enough healing items. I just... Yep. Oh, I'm not healing that. Just kill me. Something kill me. There's no point healing that. That would have just been a waste of items. Okay, where are you? It'd be quite funny if this if this is a double whammy fail in <laughs> one episode. Well, I mean that would be clear indication that um, my gear is not even close to good enough. Even though I mean I don't even know what else I can upgrade to be honest. I mean my Rajang weapon's pretty damn good. My armor's like pretty much as good as you can get for now. It's even upgraded a little bit. Um, I mean you can get better armor technically. But I really don't want to have to, you know, like, grind out, like, 20 hunts of something. So I think this is a clear indication that I'm not even... I don't even know if I'm going to be able to finish this game. If I'm not if I'm not willing to do heaps of grinding, I'm definitely not going to ever kill Fatalis in this game. Um, even you can loss, and that's pretty hard if you don't have good gear. Should be able to do at least like a Cantor and stuff though. That's not that bad. The Cantor is pretty easy. I say that now, I'm sure when I get up to it I'm going to fail like five times in a row now. Is it easy on my other character? <laughs> I'll say that. I hate that move so much. It's so bad. I think I'm just too used to the new games. Like, the hitboxes in this game is just so trash. It's hard to play. Really? Why are you going for me now? Like, if the hitboxes in this game were the modern hitboxes, it would be a lot easier. <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, Bullfangers again, of course. Just die. I didn't mean me. Oh, okay. Oh, and he's angry now. Missed. <laughs> and we're gonna get hit by Bullfango. And yes, I know, I can kill the bullfangos, but it's it's not worth it, I'll die them if I try it. Ah, supplies delivered, finally. I'm surprised I didn't get hit by a thunderbug there, to be honest. Please do something useful, you stupid cat. I've never, re I like, I never realised how, how useless the cats really are in this game until... Oh, I've obviously played the future games, but even when I played Portable Third, like I came back to this game fine, and I didn't think how useless they were or not. Um, like in games like World and Up, obviously, um, the cats are insanely use useful. Oh yay! Don't you just love being <laughs> gang banged in a corner? Don't answer that question, I don't want to know your answer, <laughs> if, if you have an answer. Oh, hi there. Can you get out of that area? Yep, you're running to the cat. God, so the cat is good and bad at the same time. Good for distractions, absolutely useless at the same time. And also bad for distractions, because, I mean, I didn't want him distracted. Oh, my God, this is... This makes me never want to play this game again. 
Oh my god, I hate this game so much. I've never had issues with this game like this before. Like when I played on the PSP, like my brother and that, they would rage like crazy to the game. I never would. I always found it, you know, I never had issues. But I'm now understanding what they felt. Of course, Bullfango, why not? Look. If you, I was going to say, if you get me killed, I'll be annoyed, but I, had, I just had to get rid of it. It's too bloody annoying. Really? Why, why was it looking at the cat and then it did the nearby attack? I thought it was going to do the uh, distance one. There's really no way to tell what it's doing half the time. And of course, insane chip damage from a drive-by. Yeah, and then you're the distance one. Just pick one. Which one? I've got I've got no clue to which one it's gonna be doing. Which one? Yeah, this one. That one's not bad, because you can actually hit him. Distance one's fine as well, but the one where it goes around him is annoying. Which one? Distance! <laughs> I have zero knowledge of which one it is. I don't actually think there's a tell, you just kind of have to guess. Oh. Well, all that complaining and it wasn't even hard. God, I'm a negative Nancy. <laughs> Anytime I have a little bit of difficulty, I just complain. I think I'm pretty sure I need a card light wars, that's good. How many times did we die? Was it once or twice? I'm not sure. Uh, just once. That's not bad. Oh, I've got a new thing. Pretty sure that's an award, I can't actually remember. Get me honey. Okay, um, well thank you guys for watching. Sorry about, well the wrath loss not working out, but um, sorry about all the complaining. I've just, I guess I'm just, I've been very stressed the past day, trying to get the demo working, um, getting it out in time. I'm not kidding, like last night I uploaded it with 20 minutes to spare. Like if I was 20 minutes, like if it cancelled, because my internet sometimes cuts out when it's uploading, if that happened I wouldn't have been able to be in the Steam Next Fest, and that would have been quite annoying. Um, so yeah, I've, I've just been real stressed, um, so forgive me for being really negative, I'm sorry. Um, I'll try and be better for the next episodes. But thank you guys for watching, um, I've obviously got to upgrade my gear, it is trash. Um, but I'll see you guys in the next, oh sorry, I'll see you guys in the next one, bye.